Hello everyone and welcome back to Night Ghost 49 as we play the Old Republic with Rezenthral the Bounty Hunter. So we have gotten our token to be on the Great Hunt. We are going to check in here in Droban Koss and go to the Mandalorian Enclave. So that's where we're at. I, I did play one more one more uh, flashpoint and I got another of this duster uh, mount that I can't actually do anything with. I mostly was bored one night, and I got the itch to play, and I, I just had to. I just had to play. Let's get our astrometric droid out there. Oh, look at him. Big-headed cutie. Yep, I said it. I said it. Get over it. All right, let's check in. Ugh, spaceports all smell the same. Engine exhaust, coolant fluid, and spacers who haven't bathed in a week. Let's get out of this stink. Whatever the rest of Drummondkos is like, the air has got to be fresher than in here. I would have figured you'd been to Drummondkos before. Brayden and I moved around a lot when we first got together, but we never made it here. Just a reminder, this is an imperial world, which means rules, rules, and more rules. If we tweak the local authorities, they can make life really hard. My goal is to join the Great Hunt. That's it. Still, let's try to keep a low profile. Come on, the Mandalorian Enclave is in the Citadel. Our contact is someone named Chris DeMarcon. Alright. Let's get out of here. Apparently it smells horrible. <clears throat> and Mako doesn't like that. We need a helmet. You know? Like a good old Mandalorian one. That'll look good in this bad boy. Alright. Let's go. I still have my sprint. We're going to be rocking and rolling here. Um, like I said, I'm not going to cut out a lot of this stuff unless it's some like really long traveling or something like that because I feel like, I don't know, you got to have the experience. I don't want it all cut out. Look, Sith Lords over there, the Empire flags, banners, all that good stuff. Um, I was hoping to be able to go to like a market and buy some things, but it doesn't look like that's the case. What can I get for you? Does this guy have anything that's good? Like, these aren't going to be any good, are they? Yeah, the thing on the right is a power generator. Alright. <clears throat> yeah, this is... Bleh. That's garbage. Uh, unsecured premium offhand case. So it's like a random case. No. Come back anytime. Yeah, I'll come back and not buy random can things from you. Can I take a look at our ordinance? Uh, none of these are going to be any good, are they? No. Okay, just random. The Empire. I was hoping to get to a the intergalactic market and maybe do some trading or something like that, but never mind. All right. Sheesh, it's so dark. Let's see what time it is here. It is. Oh, it is. Dark. It's always just gloomy. Lovely. <laughs> All right, where are we heading? Uh, we need to go to Cost City. And is that going to be a speeder? Run? Ready for departure. Yes. Let's do it. Let's go to Cast City. You know, I might, I might be missing out on something actually. Now that I think about it, Ooh, we're going up and over that. What the? There's a gun dark like charging that whole area. What the heck? Can I look around? Oh, I like the look of him on a speeder. That looks good. It's pretty awesome. All right, this isn't the city. Roman costs wilds. There are some quests, but those are for the heroic quests. There aren't like uh, quests that I've seen so far. Who are these guys? I'm going a little too fast. Can't actually click on them. All right, that's fine. We seem to be constantly running into speeders that are going back to the spaceport, so that's kind of funny. All right, let's get out of here. Hello. Welcome to Cost City. Oh wait. Make sure we unlock this. There we go. I never know if you if you actually like unlock things. Well, I guess all of these are technically unlocked. Oh, the Mandalorian Enclave. We can just go to it right there. Oh, but hold on. We've, we've got to actually follow the quest. Okay. Never mind. I thought I'd be cute and like actually like scoot ahead, but that is not the case. All right, who's this guy? I clicked on Mako. 
New face on driving cars. Interesting. Uh, uh never mind. I guess I could have just gone in there from the beginning. Let's check and see what this quest is right here. And then we'll go in and check the Mon Mandalorian en Enclave. I'm probably just going to quick travel. Honestly, I'm super incredibly lazy. Wow, there, that must wow there's a lot of quests. That's the center of the universe as far as the Empire is concerned. Yeah, no kidding. How big do you think those flags are? Uh, that's a good... Oh, look at that! There's a destroyer just chilling up there. And those things are floating. What flags are you talking about? Oh well, let's see what this guy needs. Seven brutal bloody murders. Seven. And the killer is allowed to walk free. Decent, law-abiding citizens, loyal servants of the Emperor, are being slaughtered. And what do our security forces do? Nothing. I've seen the killer myself. But the authorities say I don't have enough proof. I demand justice. What makes you think I care? Well, I, I'm not fit to confront such an individual, but someone has to. Several days ago, I spotted a bounty hunter following people seemingly at random, but pointing a strange device at them. The descriptions of the murder victims exactly match the people the hunter was following. He's behind these brutal killings, I know it. That sounds like a bit of a stretch. No, I know what I saw, I, I made no mistakes, I'm sure of it. I followed the killer this morning. Saw the filthy alien skulking into the Mandalorian enclave. Someone called him by name, Redigan. This bounty hunter must learn the Empire doesn't tolerate alien scum like him killing its citizens. He needs to be punished. Um, okay. So, that's odd. Somebody in the Mandalorian Enclave. I guess we're going... That is cool. I want one of those. I guess we're going in there. Might as well see if we can talk to him. These are going to be heroic yeah, PvP terminals and Stronghold Commissioner. No, thank you. You know what? Let's just go. Let's just get out of here. Mandalorian Enclave. I want a special shuttle, please. Thank you. Uh, Sith Lordre? You're invisible, friend. You might want to get that looked at. Just saying. Okay. Wait, there's somebody back here to talk to. Let's go ahead and check this out. Ooh, the Mandalorian Enclave. I'll have to look at the uh, codex later. Who's this guy? I've got a shuttle to catch. You mind getting out of my way? Fleeing the scene of your crimes, Renegan? Just my luck. Ten seconds later and I would have been off this blasted planet. You've been listening to Wrightson. Great. Listen, I didn't murder anybody. I was just hired to tag some random citizens, that's all. You didn't ask why you were hired to tag random people? You know this business. If the credits are good, no questions asked. I didn't know my clients would kill those people. I was hired by a group of Sith to organize games for them. Didn't realize what that meant until bodies started piling up. When I confronted them, they laughed. Said Sith have a birthright to hunt lowlifes. It's like a sport to them. Where do we go from here? I'm not taking the blame for something I didn't do. I'm in over my head, and too many people are watching me now, so I can't even leave. I need help, and I'm willing to pay for it. You interested? I'll see what I can do. I just want this problem to go away, and I only see two ways for that to happen. Either get rid of the loudmouth pointing fingers at me, or end that sick game the Sith are playing. Honestly, I'm not interested. I ain't got time for that noise. We got the great hunt to go on. It just seems like a weird quest. I, I don't want anything to do with it. I'm just going to keep going. Like, I don't need to... Hey, welcome to Dromenkos. I've never been here before. I'm going to murder a citizen. Or, hey, welcome to Dromenkos. You know how those Sith control practically everything and dish out money like crazy to good bounty hunters? Yeah, I'm gonna kill them. Yeah, that's What's not that what I'm gonna do. Like, seriously. So, Power Tech has, uh, this is our class specialization. It fires a neural dart that taunts a target, forcing it to attack you. Player, player targets deal 30% less damage when attacking anyone other than you. Oh, interesting. Dude, 
Dude, get a room. Like, what are you doing? Okay. Um, that's weird. So that's the taunt. I will put that... No, I'll put that up over here. By the way, I switched out my flamethrower and the flame sweep. I don't think the flame sweep is that good, honestly. It's, it's, yeah, it's not that great. Uh, we also have guard, which it looks like it's, it's a stance. While active, the guarded player takes 5% less damage and generate 25%. Wait, takes 5% less damage and generates 25% less threat? In addition, so long as you remain within 15 meters, the guarded player. Fifty percent of all incoming damage from enemy players is transferred back to you. Requires a gas cylinder. Huh? I do not understand that. That feels opposite of like a tank. You generate less threat. Weird. That is very very weird. Okay. Uh, we have energy shield increases. Damage or er, yeah, damage reduction by 25% for 15 seconds. That's really good. Heroic moment sees the moment, restoring 2% of maximum health every three seconds. Requires an active companion. Interesting. I didn't know those actually required companions. Huh. All right. Well, we've, we've trained up. That's nice. I took far too long to actually train up. All right. Let's go talk to this person. <laughs> and then I told him, "You think that's cold?" You should see what I did to the Gamorrean. I never saw a Rodian run so fast in my... Whoa. Hello, handsome. You here to sweep me off my feet? We are here for the Great Hunt. We've been sponsored by Nemro the Hut. Oh, what's this? Got yourself a pet? Little sister, maybe? It's not enough to hold a real man's interest, anyway. Mako's my backup. That's all you need to know. Didn't mean anything. It's just rare we get any fresh meat in here worth putting on the grill. Can you change the subject already? Oh, don't get your blaster jammed. You probably ain't gonna like what I'm about to tell you. But there's nothing I can do about it, understand? There's one spot left open in the Great Hunt. And over three dozen hunters who got sponsorships. Those other hunters can go home. That spot is mine. It's yours if you can get it. Lots of folks will be thinking the same thing, though. The Huntmaster himself will explain how we're going to sort things out. Head into the main room and show some respect. When the Huntmaster's done talking, come on back in here. I'll be handling you from here on out. This seems to be a common theme. Selling too many tickets, not having enough seats. Seriously, people. We, it, this is like the, intergal the intergalactic world here. And we can't handle this whole situation. Wookie! Are we, are we freaked out? Do I need to... No, we're good. Quiet! Quiet, you dogs! The Huntmaster is about to speak. Pay attention and show some respect for once in your lives. Uh. You heard the hunt master. You're competing for the last spot in the great hunt by taking down three bounties on Droman Kos. You expect us to hunt here with Imperials crawling all over us and Sith? If you're afraid to compete, the spaceport's that away. Yes, that's the spirit. For all you overblown, useless, no talent cowards. We installed a handy exit door. Use it now! The rest of you, the real hunters, go see your handlers. They'll get you oriented to the planet and assign you three unique bounties. Everyone who takes down all three of their bounties wins a spot in the final melee. Anyone who doesn't get all three is out. Hunting on Drummond Koss? That's suicide. I'm grabbing the first shuttle out of here. I suggest you do the same, friend. You'll be one less body for me to step over. At least you got the attitude right. Don't expect this world to roll over for you, though. I'm done here. May your quarry fall before you, Hunter. Well, what are you standing around for? Back to your handler. That's Krista for you, new blood. 
Okay, the Wookiee? Really? <laughs> that was incredibly loud. Alright, well, uh, three guys, three or four guys pieced out, so that's good. A dozen cowards just scurried out of here. Probably won't stop till Droman Kaos is light years behind him. You understand the basics, right? Three bounties, hardest targets on Droman Kaos. Gotta get all three to qualify for the final melee. What exactly is this melee I keep hearing about? Ooh, it's a big old scrap. Everybody who gets all three of their bounties goes into the rage pit. One comes out. Now let's see who your first target is. Whoa, this can't be right. You got enemies among the Mandalorians or something? Just Taro Blood, the Mandalorian who killed Brayden. What'd he do? What's the job? I wouldn't wish this bounty on anybody. Gotta play the hand you're dealt, though. The target's a Republic noble named Valtaka. He got captured during an Imperial raid, brought back here, and sold into slavery by mistake. Why was selling him into slavery a mistake? He should have been ransomed, but Altaka wasn't properly identified when he got captured. Altaka's slave group was building a big old statue in the jungle. The slaves rebelled and took over the site. Nobody can get in there. We don't even know if he's still alive. If he is, the family will pay big. I've been looking to earn some real credits for a change. Well, now's your chance, assuming you can ever find the guy. The slaves got themselves a tent camp near that statue they never finished. If Altaka's still kicking, he's probably somewhere in there. Before you go, meet your new best friend. The S-86K full-gauge carbonite armor upgrade. You can't shoot a fella with this while he's springing around. It's too slow to charge up. But once that fella ain't resisting, say, after a good long beating, the S-86K will freeze him for transport. Hmm. Huh. Didn't know they made devices to freeze people. Carbonite ain't so much freezing as it is... Well, I ain't got a clue, really. <laughs> Just have fun. You find that Republic noble fella and claim that first bounty, then hurry it on back here as fast as you can. I thought for a second she was going to give me a weapon. I was getting a little excited. Congratulations, level 17. Okay, come on game. You don't need to be advertising to me right away. Alright, let's go ahead and train up real quick. Looks like we're gonna have to go to the big statue that is uh, that's out in the jungle, apparently. Oh, that Mandalorian armor is pretty cool. Ooh, what's this? A lore object? Mandalorians. I'll have to check that out later. <clears throat> you got anything for me? You well, really don't, you. do you? That sucks. Okay. Level 20. Level 20. Hopefully we can get a speeder by then and uh, get things rocking and rolling here. Let's let's leave the Enclave. Maybe I can do a fast travel to get out to the jungle a little bit quicker. So let's get out of here first. Let's check our mail. We have one piece of mail right now. Safe on Coruscant. Probably going to find this silly, but I wanted to tell you I made it home in one piece after you saved me from Fothra's palace. I know it wasn't the reason why you were there, but I can't think of anyone on Hutta who wouldn't have had just just shot me for the credits in the po in in my pocket, let alone an imperial bounty. So I hope this helps you on a great hunt. Be careful out there. It wasn't hard for me to dig up the address. Huh. Thank you, partner, for her blaster. I don't think I'll be able to sleep without it for a while. Yeah, she, she got in a bad way. Um, 95 credits? That's not too bad. That's the girl that we saved. Well, we ended up not killing. And uh, I think I think it was a good choice. I don't really regret that. Okay, so somewhere... At, wow, out in the jungle. The unfinished Colossus. Let's see how close we can get to that thing. Looks like we can go to the outpost Tempest. Let's go ahead and do that, and then we will head southeast. Let's see if we can get close to that uh, big statue. Let's find ourselves a Republic noble and freezing good. Uh, I'm inside you. That's... I don't like it. Okay. Do I have any other quests here before we head on out? What is this one? Is this heroic quest? Jelishka Changa Waning Chinkuspa Inegudae Naka Noya Chorski Noyo Kachuso de Mate Chichoya
You lost me. Naka no ya choski, no yo kachuso de mate chichoya. Chupolo, wa wonder kopotomte tak makechisa. Kiko ubakili, wata bunga dunko, putoga wata. What's in it for me? Mi umpi putamala, bet wana nibo chi chichupa gumba. Supuda no pajunki, paguta ji uta vukise. You got yourself a deal. Chiho lukuta, chubu ikatsfu, undole. Bafu pagi wanta humpa, muli rabamba hula. All right, for everybody else who doesn't speak uh, Twi'lek, he said there's a big dude out there. His name is Craig. Or Craig, not not Craig. This is Craig, and he. We have to kill eight of his dudes, and then take him out as well. And he's a Mandalorian. It's not 100% along the way, but you know what? We could use the credits and the honor. I think I am going to untrack. What? Where's the sport hunting? Yeah, let's get rid of that one. That's the one I don't want anything to do with. I don't want anything to do with that mess with the Sith and Bounty Hunter, like, eh, whatever, let him deal with it. Okay, oh, good night. Oh, they're level 10! Okay, that's not too bad. I was, like, freaking out. Alright, Mako, let's take these fools on. Let's see if I can start them off. Are they picking mushrooms? Let's see, they... Oh, dude, with the interrupt! Seriously! He was picking mushrooms with his little friend over here. And, uh, I interrupted that. How rude of me. Stab that fool. Give him a little fire. They're pretty tough. I'm not even scaled down. They're, uh, they're pretty beefy. Oh, my, my heat's too high. Okay, I was like, nothing is going on. Let me relook at this guard real quick. The guarded player takes 5% less damage and generates 25%. Less threat. Doesn't make any sense to me. I don't even know why you would use that. I generate less threat. And I take less damage. Maybe if I don't want to actually be the tank in the situation, you can use that in a group so that you're not pulling aggro. I mean, that's the only thing that I can really think of. That guy's having fun. Alright, let's go ahead and hit this guy for a little bit. Alright, I need to close the distance. So that I can actually do some real damage. Let's hit him. Use the uh is it rail shot? Yeah, rail shot. We'll do some flames on him as well. Nice. Three out of the eight. Is this just a bonus objective? No, it's actually part of it. Alright. Let's see if I can nope, my uh death from above does have a much smaller radius than I thought, so let's go ahead and flame him up a little bit. And then we'll hit him and do rail shot. We'll finish him off with just some basic shots so we don't use up all of our heat. Because we're actually pretty warm right now. It's a little weird saying that, isn't it? I don't want to use up all my heat. Alright, five out of eight. We've got a few more to go before we mess with Craig's locker. <laughs> well, I just want to call him Craig. Like, it's Craig! I don't know, it just sounds like such a basic name, not like... Craig the Destroyer. Strength attracts strength, you know? Why are those guys, like, stunned at all? It's weird to me. Alright, let's get a little closer. Now, Mako is healing us quite nicely. Again, every single time I go to use that channel ability, he hits me with the stun. He's good. Let's, let's do the flame and get both of them. We're using the same abilities against each other. It's kind of funny. Give him a good stab. Yeah, I actually generate a ton of heat with the abilities in the right now. Okay, I need one more. These Mandalorians are nice. I wish they would drop the armor that they're actually wearing. I could use it, friend. Alright, we need one more Mandalorian. One more Mandalorian. Seem to be heading in groups of two. Okay. 
Maybe that was the other person over there actually initiating the quest. Ooh, is that guy by himself? Yes. The Mandalorian Equalizer. Let's see if we can just get him by himself. Let's see if he'll if he does it. Channel. Oh, he's channeling something right now, so he didn't interrupt me. Nice. Sweet! Alright, so we got his Mandalorians. Now we need to go back and defeat him. So draw out and defeat Craig. Oh, there's more of them. Uh, use this. Let's see. Pass allows you to travel to a safe area near the objective. Personal challenge on Droman Castle. What? Really? That's odd. I don't remember getting these little, like, personal transports before. That's really weird. I mean, it's cool. It just zips you over to it, right? So we gotta do something here? Yeah. Something with this locker. Death Craig. There he is. Hello, good sir. Use an explosive round on him as well. Get closer. Flames, baby. Let's get oh, I have an energy shield too. Yeah, I like them apples. You inspired me to use mine. He's a level 11 elite, the champion, I should say. I'm just gonna keep stabbing him. Should really do something with fire so he has a little damage over time on him. Maybe a little bit of punching too. There we go. Trying to find a good rotation. I don't know if I'm quite using the right uh, set so far. So his shield's down, but so is mine. Give him a good punch. That does a decent amount of damage. Did I do rocket punch? I think I've got way too much heat for that, actually. All right, we're going to get five crystals, and then I get to select one reward that I can't actually do anything with. So, happy day. All right. We are done with that. Now we're going to go down to our story quest. And go find the Slave Republic Noble. And see if we can freeze him in Carbonite. He might not be there. He might be dead, actually. They were saying they weren't quite sure, so uh, let's go ahead and head south. And figure out what's going on. I think I need to go... Do I need to go through that little checkpoint? Maybe? Probably. Looks like they've got this area kind of sectioned off. We flew right over this when we got here, because we took a speeder, which I looked fantastic in, might I add. Yeah, I'm pretty sure this is not where the slaves will be down that way. Nope, nope, probably some quest to actually kill Gundarks or whatever those guys are. So we'll head through here, and then go off to, it looks like the left. Well, we already got a quest reward, so he probably allows that heroic to be daily or something like that. I'm not really sure. Okay, can we start to see a statue or anything? Because it says that they're in the jungle building some colossus or whatever. Ooh, I don't want to aggro those things if I don't need to. But I can walk by. He's level 11. I'm 17. He's not going to do anything. He knows who's stronger. All right, these guys are good. Imperial defenders. Unfinished colossus. Did we discover this finally? Oh, he is back this way. Okay, good. And there is a quest up here, so let's go ahead and talk to this guy or gal. Lord Drowl. Exactly as reported. A degree six revolt, population equivalent to the Duros uprising on Zilior. Subjects occupy a moderate radius of jungle. Good. Good. What have we here? A hunter? I have need of you. I am Lord Drowl. When the Empire encounters resistance on its conquered worlds, they call me. I'm here to end the slave uprising on Drummond Kass. I wasn't aware there was a slave revolt going on. Very soon there won't be. You can assist me in ending it. The situation is this. A Sith Lord was constructing a colossal statue of himself in the jungle. His slaves revolted and armed themselves. The Colossus remains unfinished and well-armed slaves now control the jungle. An embarrassment for the Empire, but an opportunity for me. Don't leave me hanging. Excited? Good. 
This is a chance to refine the Empire's methods of suppressing rebellion. I'm testing a toxic weapon, a poison called Quell. Its victims experience a prolonged state of agonizing pain before finally dying. The victim's allies are so horrified by Quell's effects, they lose their wills to resist. At least that's what I intend to prove. That's not good to hear. That's one of the things I love best about it. I need someone to introduce a controlled amount of Quell into the slave's water supply, so that I can determine the proper dosage. The work is dangerous, there will be armed slaves everywhere. But your success will be well rewarded. What do you say? You can rely on me. Superb. Then let's get started. My assistant, Sergeant Slerin, will recommend the correct dosage of Quell and give you a supply. See him at the research tent.